Hallelujah, glory be to God. I welcome you all in the mighty name of Jesus. If this is your first time seeing me or coming across my channel, thank you so much for making that decision to click on this video. I pray may this ministration bless your life in the mighty name of Jesus. And for those that are returning as family, thank you all so much for supporting me. Thank you all so much for your love. I pray may the Lord bless and increase you all in the name of Jesus. Amen. The Lord says, I should tell someone, you are the one blocking your blessings. The Lord says, you are the one blocking your blessings. This person I'm talking to, someone did something to you in the past. Ever since you were hurt and you've not taken this thing out of your heart. You are so angry with this person and you've kept this person in your heart. The Lord says, forgive and let go. The Bible says in the book of Matthew chapter 6 verse 14 and 15, For if you forgive men their trespasses, your heavenly Father will also forgive you. But if you do not forgive men their trespasses, neither will your Father forgive your own trespasses. Hallelujah. This is the word of the Lord. The Bible says, when someone does something to you, forgive them so that your heavenly Father will also forgive you. I don't know who has hurt you. I don't know if this person hurt you in time past. I don't know if you're still in that hurt. The Lord says, forgive and let go. Take it off your heart so that God can release your blessings. The reason why you have been praying to God and you have not received answers is because you're holding this person in your heart. That is why the Bible says, when you bring your gift to the altar, then you remember that you have a problem with your brother. First of all, drop your offering. Go back and make peace with your brother before you come and drop that offering. Because if you give the offering with someone in your heart, God is not going to reward you. The blessings that come with an offering will not locate you because you're hurt and you're holding someone in your heart. That is the spirit of unforgiveness. The Lord says, I should tell you right now, please obey the voice of the Lord. That person that is in your heart, take them off and have your peace in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Lord, I thank you for this prophetic word. I pray for everyone that is connected to this word. Whoever has heard them, Lord, may you give them the ability to forgive and let go in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you all so much for being a part of this session. I hope you receive this word with gladness. Please do not forget to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so I never upload new content. You will be the first to know. I love you all so much, family. Yes, I do love you. I love you. God bless you. And see you in our next session. Shalom.